Hello everyone, hope you're doing well and staying safe. My name is Alan Liu, and I'm a third year guitarist here at Curtis, and today I'll be playing Nine Variations on God Save Francis the Emperor by Matieka. Matieka was a Czech guitarist and composer who lived between 1773 and 1830. Upon completion of his legal and musical studies in Prague, he accepted a position in the service of Count Kinski. Count Kinski was one of Beethoven's original sponsors and was also the employer of Matieka's uh, mentor, Joseph Jelinek. Later, Matieka moved to Vienna, where he remained until his final years. Matieka's opus sung, The Nine Variations, is based on a theme written by Joseph Haydn. The original piece, um, God Save Francis the Emperor, was Haydn's anthem to Francis II, the emperor of the Holy Roman Empire, then later the Austrian Empire. Haydn also used the same melody in the second movement of his string quartet number no. three, Opus 76, which is also known as the Emperor Quartet. I hope you enjoy.
I'm Xinxin Yao from China. I'm 15, and this is my first year at Curtis. Today, I will perform Fernando Suarez Opus Six Number Three and Opus Five Number Five on Dante Largo. Suarez was born in Barcelona, Spain, in 1778, a child prodigy as a composer. He was also a guitarist and singer. Suarez's first opera was composed and performed at the age of 17. Later on, he became known for his ballets, the most famous of which was the setting of the Cinderella story. This ballet was very popular and was given more than 100 performances from Paris to Saint Petersburg. Sor was highly thought of a guitar virtuoso, even appearing on the same program as the Young Franz Liszt. The two pieces I will be playing are compositions that were published during the early part of Sor's career. The first is a short etude featuring left-hand articulation. The second is a beautiful slow piece in ABA sound form. I enjoy playing this music because of how beautifully composed it is for the guitar, almost like a small orchestra with individual voices. I hope you can enjoy.
Hello everyone, thank you for joining. My name is John Williams. I'm in my final year at Curtis of the diploma degree. Tonight I'm going to play two movements from Wenzel Matieka's B minor sonata, opus 23. Alan already spoke to you a bit earlier about Matieka, uh, but I'll share a little more. One of, the, one of the pieces he's most known for today is his opus 21 trio, which was for flute, guitar, and viola. Um, but this piece was made most famous because Schubert actually arranged it, uh, adapted it for quartet, and added a very virtuosic cello part, probably for his father to play. Um, and actually, the connection to Matieka as the original source wasn't known for a while uh, until they found his, his manuscript dated in 1811. Um, and interestingly enough, the Matieka sonata that I'm playing tonight is Matieka's arrangement, partial arrangement transcription of a Haydn sonata published in 1776. So the first movement that I'm playing was is a partial transcription of the last movement of a Haydn piano sonata. Um, and then I'm also playing the third movement, which is Matieka's, uh, Matieka's original uh, composition. So thank you so much for joining and I hope you enjoyed. Thank you. 
Hello everyone, my name is Hao. Thank you so much for joining us on this recital. I'm going to play Sonata Giocosa by Joaquin Rodrigo for you. Rodrigo is one of Spain's most famous and important composers in the 20th century. He was blinded just at the age of three, but continued to compose music throughout his life. Victoria, his wife, who was also a pianist, worked alongside with Rodrigo. She was really dedicated to him and his musical career. She notated music for him and also read the world for him. So she really became his eyes and his hands in his entire life. This sonata is in traditional form with three movements, fast, slow, fast. The first movement is rhythmic, lively, and cheerful. The second movement is as a contrast is more uh, meditative and solemn. The last movement is a vic vigorous um, sapatiato with again strong rhythm and full of wit and charm. I hope you will enjoy.
Thank mm-hmm. you.